In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a manual cron to Cloudways if you're using Cloudways as your web hosting provider. I've been using Cloudways as my hosting company for the past, I don't know, it's about two years now. And I've been asked this question by a lot of people here on the channel. So here you go. This is how you do it. Now, the reason why people are asking this, because I made a video about three weeks ago about how to add a manual cron to WordPress and uh, it wasn't uh, so clear on how to do it for Cloudways. So I'm coming back and I'm right back at you. So I'm gonna have a link in the video description box down below to that video. Now it was all in regards to this plugin that is about to be officially released. It's available now, it's a free cart abandonment solution for WordPress, it's full featured. Now what happens is it, someone, someone goes to your checkout starts putting their information in and then they don't check out that information's captured and an email can be scheduled to go out in an hour and a day and a couple days. Now those actions need to happen and be triggered by this thing called the cron and the one that comes built in with WordPress is not reliable. So it's best to put a manual cron in and that's what we're going to do. So I'll have a link down below to that plugin if you want to check that out. So here we are, I'm logged in and I'm in a particular application. Now I'm going to end up deleting this application. That's the only reason why I'm showing it here now to you. But what we need to do first is get our app ID. And so right here underneath where it says database name, I'm on the access details. This is actually the app ID and it's used for your database name and your username. And you can click right there and it puts it into the clipboard, which makes it very easy for what we're going to do. Next, you're going to want to click right here where it says cron job management. Click on that. It's going to take us here. We'll click on advanced and now we need to put something in here. Well, I have it right here on this notepad. Now I have a link below to a blog post on my website where you can easily copy and paste this. Now there's one little bit of code or text that we need to change right here. And it's where it says XXX app ID XXX. We need to highlight that and paste in that app ID that we already copied just a moment ago from Cloudways. And this is all ready to go. So I can go ahead and select it all. I can copy it into my clipboard. I can go here, click right there, paste it in, click on save changes. And there it is, your, your job's done. Now your cron is going to trigger reliably every five minutes. And so if there's anything scheduled that needs to happen, it's going to happen reliably now. Hey, if useful videos like this matter to you, consider clicking on the subscribe button, the notification bell. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. I'll have links to everything down in the video description box down below, including a 10% off coupon for Cloudways if you want to use them as your hosting provider as well. Hey, thank you for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.